everyone, how are you guys doing? It is 20 past five in the morning and I am leaving the apartment here in London, Shmiran Fustu's apartment, you may recognize the car park, um, to go down to the Eurotop because today I'm embarking on a trip with Mr. JWW, uh, Paul from Supercars of London, TM and Tide, Sam, seeing through glass. And we are driving all the way to Austria today. Uh, I have only slept, James is here, he's getting his car from downstairs, but uh, he slept over last night and we've only slept maybe three hours. Here he comes, so I'm gonna need to hop in the car. But yeah, let's head to Austria. As I'm sure you can tell, it's nighttime outside and James, who is leading in front. Oops, yeah, I need to put my lights on. I just realized it's nighttime and I don't have lights on. James is in front and uh, we are heading to the Eurotunnel. It says one hour, 27 minutes, arrival time, seven o'clock. We have to be there for around 7.15. That's when Paul and Sam are going there. So yeah, stuff we do to get some good content, man. 14 hours of driving today, or three hours sleep. Great idea. We gotta go. I have rarely seen London so empty, guys. This is insane. James and I terrorizing the streets of London at 5.37 in the morning. Hello. It's green again. James, I'm just, I've pulled over on the side waiting for him. Let me put this up like a good citizen. Don't know if Paul and Sam are here yet, but uh, we are, yeah, we got loads of time. So we should be all right. <laughs> Paul's here. <laughs> oh, that's so cool. That is so, so, that is so cool. <laughs> so obviously we've arrived. <laughs> that was a bit of a giveaway. And literally as we arrive, Paul arrives. So that's pretty cool. Oh, yes! Oh, yes! Copyright! The Bieber! strong! Mate, it looks incredible! Woohoo! <laughs> There's new Bieber on Radio 1. Oh, yeah, I know, it's fine. Mate, honestly, yeah, it looks are. unbelievable. So wide. I know. I that is so nice. Yeah. Ooh. 
James is just reorganizing his luggage. <laughs> Sam is here. <laughs> that exhaust is crazy. <laughs> oh, that's so cool. Oh, hi, look at that. <laughs> Morning. Oh, there's an SLS, there's those lads over there. No, it's pretty good. This is the inside of Paul's car. It's unbelievable. I'm so jealous of his comfort because obviously I'm going to be without music in uh, uncomfort and he's going to be all in his luxury. You're basically driving a Rolls Royce there. Yeah, Rolls Royce? It's more sporty than a Rolls Royce. Yeah. <laughs> can go sideways easier. <laughs> yes, that's true, that's true. Cheeky spot of morning breakfast, got a bit of a muffin. Bacon and egg muffin, that's how it's done. Everyone's here. Elizabeth is here too, it's quite noise. I am going to eat this. <laughs> I'm going to hand it to someone, like, I'm eating this, here, take it, eat. We're driving to the queue then. We've had our lunch, and now we are heading onwards to the queue. We, our train was delayed slash cancelled, so hopefully this won't be too much of a nightmare. There we go, ladies and gents. We seem to have made it to this stop, whatever you'd call this stop, um, the before, before boarding the train stop. I believe we're about to move onto the train, so this is exciting. basically got our own carriage, one other person, and we've already started moving. There's another train chasing us there. Oh, we're out! See you soon, England! Because we have a 12-hour drive ahead of us, and I only slept three hours last night, I decided I'm gonna sleep, and I've chosen to go in Paul's car, purely because it's the most comfortable. So, good night, people. We're here, we are in France. And the weather's not as nice as it was in the UK. And I didn't manage to sleep, if you're wondering. Great. We have 
foot traffic. Woo! -hoo. I'm also completely by myself with no radio because my radio's out of battery. So great. Uh, you know what? The thing about these deer's trick to hold is that they're loads of fun. been updated on the situation. Apparently, it's Sirway's Burger King. Uh, there is a genuine Burger King. Oh, there is. A, I was like, I was like, okay. Okay, okay. I see, I see. How is the autobahn for you? I, I much prefer driving the autobahn because when there's no speed limit, you don't feel like you're doing anything wrong. Even though we're not doing anything wrong in France, we're just at cruise control 130. You're just like, yeah. I don't know, like, but, I know when, when you're you no when you're just limit. sitting at 180, just like cruising yeah. with your music on, <laughs> yeah. and you look down and you're like. 180. Yeah. So uh, I think I hit 130. Oh wow. Yeah. Well done. Yeah. <laughs> I just let him on and out. On. Okay. Yeah, I was thinking. I was like, <laughs> great, great, Paul. <laughs> you did the speed limit in France. <laughs> All the cars are absolutely filthy, obviously. But from here, it's about a three-hour drive to our hotel. Though I'm too exhausted to keep driving. We've got another three hours and 40 minutes to go. So I'm gonna get a hotel. No, okay. <laughs> Sam's gonna drive my car and Elizabeth is gonna drive his, and I'm gonna sleep for about an hour to recharge my batteries and then take over again. You excited? Yeah, man. Cool. Come on, focus. Here we go. Sam is leading in my car, but it's weird seeing someone else. Yeah, my car's probably not a battery, so I won't be making a video of this. Damn it. <laughs> Whoa, night mode is so cool on my camera. I've just woken up. Uh, it's the like the middle of the night, well, the middle of the night. It's like 10 o'clock, pretty much. Uh, I've had a bit of a nap. I've just radioed through to Sam, who is like, your car is so loud, I need to get out of here. So we're gonna switch at the next possible stop where we can, and then I'm gonna take over. We've still got two hours to go. And we literally, we left home at 5 a.m. this morning. It is 10 o'clock, and the longest stop we had above the Euro tunnel was literally like a quick Burger King. So it's been so intense, but, uh, Whoa. Yeah, wow. Thanks for driving me, Elizabeth. Oh, you're welcome. <laughs> yeah. Let's get into the car and let's just power on to Innsbruck.
I'm exhausted, but we've arrived. And my bag's also about to, yeah, there we go. Anyways, all the cars are parked up. There is, there they are. There's also an RS6 um, from Apt. Tim, should be on 50, who we joined up with in his uh, 6M5LT and a Press M2. How are you feeling? Feeling, do you know what? In the grand scheme of things. Not that bad. Not that bad at all. Because yeah. <laughs> you were in like a freaking cruiser. <laughs> yeah, it was so comfortable. Oh, it, it held the road so well. And you know, the has it confirmed your choice? Oh yeah, yeah. Well, the video that I made today was why I picked the AMG GTS. The link you know, in the description. Be, I hope so. I know. <laughs> I didn't realize you were filming. Yeah. <laughs> I, I forgot my YouTube. <laughs> Tim, come say hi. <laughs> Where is he? There he is. What up? Welcome. Well, we made it. Thank you. I know. You all made it. Eventually. I'm gonna sleep for days. So I'm gonna very generously. <laughs> so I'm gonna very generously not carry any of the things you just dropped. He's an amazing person, really. <laughs> Water and khaki. Yeah. Oh, thank right, you. Right. Thank Bye. you so much. Yeah. Anyways, that's pretty much it. There will be another vlog tomorrow. Blah -de -blah -de -blah. Thanks for watching. Remember to subscribe. I'll see you soon. Ciao. Bye. So we're back in the car. I just thought I'd show you how you started. You got your push start button there. Boom. It sounds incredible. You also got this button there is to switch off the um, stop start system in the car. So I'm just going to leave the key there for now. Check out the meaty sound it's like a proper hear that it's not what i expected i didn't think it would sound that good but it's definitely like m4 levels of 